deadly windstorm has swept across the state, claiming the life of a woman, injuring several others and leaving thousands without power. The winds peaked at 120 kilometres per hour and the State Emergency Service responded to more than 600 calls for assistance. One of Melbourne's most iconic landmarks, the Rose Street Market, is at risk of disappearing as residents living in surrounding developments step up complaints to Yarra City Council. And after sweeping across the United States, creepy clowns have come to Australia. The craze began with reports of clowns trying to lure children into woodland areas of South Carolina. With sightings reported across Melbourne, police have warned anti-social behaviour will be investigated. Thanks, Simon. But this year's political landscape has a very different feel, with Americans shifting their support toward non-established candidates, giving rise to the anti-establishment movement. Outspoken Senators Darren Hinch and Pauline Hanson have come head-to-head -head on Breakfast TV after the One Nation founder defended Donald Trump's crude comments about a female American news anchor. But as commercial businesses shift away from main thoroughfares and into quiet residential back streets, local residents are frustrated by the changes they are observing. 